Salty donut. There it is. That's you. Ah, it goes in. So two years ago, I did a collaboration with the Salty Donut where I was able to do my own personal flavor twist. It had a little human edible and dog edible dog biscuit on it, and it was a sweet potato, gluten-free, cookie butter cake donut. It was really good. And we decided we wanna try to go part two, but do it completely differently. Have a couple ideas on what flavors we might do for version two, but we're gonna go take some photos down there now on my page and Salty Donuts page so we can get a little bit of feedback from the fans and see what flavors you guys can cook up. Pun intended. What, a what are we doing here? Being basic, taking photos with donuts. Hey guys, I'm on our way here. Hi, welcome. How are we looking? No, what's your relationship with donuts? A little bit more than platonic. Is Joe right now? Sometimes we do like a little shared experience thing. Joanne, myself, and the donut. Things are getting weird. I like donuts, all right? We're in the kitchen. We're about to test the flavor. I think we're gonna actually help put it together ourselves, so let's see. We got lots of options, huh? So, they don't have the toppings on it yet, but okay. you have two options. You can either do a ring or a cube. These are minis. Okay. Uh, we're gonna do full size for you, but okay. minis is what we have. Yeah, yeah. Well, Malden salt. Okay. It's like just a sea salt. Cool. We usually use it on pretty much everything. Yeah. <laughs> I, so. I just said to Bijan yesterday, I was like, the concept of sea salt on a chocolate chip cookie has yeah. been introduced to me recently. I don't know if it's been going on for years, but it's so good. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah. So it's pretty cool. It comes from the UK. Okay. And so the grain on the salt, you see how flaky yeah, it is? Yeah, yeah. These huge flakes. Flat. And so what, yeah, so what happens is it's way less salty than like your regular right. super thin like Himalayan salt. Right. So like you can have a nice big chunk of this and it's kind of crispy. Not and, it's, and it's not that salty. Yeah. Really nice soft chocolate chip cookie. Okay, I like that. So that I can I like test that. that first? Of course. Yeah. Do you see this cookie? It looks... You guys might just have to get into the cookie business now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wow, it's still a little bit warm. Is it? Yeah, yeah. I just made it. Wow. And then same thing, just like nice chunks of cookie on top. Awesome. Let's do it. Do you mind, Chef, if I get in on that a little bit? Go for it. Oh, oh yeah. That's going to be an incredibly salty dinner. Oh yeah. <laughs> this is going to be so good. Oh god. She's going to have to scoop it Has to happen. Alright y'all, ready? Andy, can you take a test for me? Yes, yeah, sure can, no problem. <laughs> no, can't do it. Let's give them like a good glass of milk to wash it all down. I, I would say you could even maybe go I don't know, heavier or thicker on the, the melted ice cream glaze. We usually do. Oh, cool. That's good. Should we try round three? So we got to try three different versions of the potential sea salt cream and cookie donut. One had a chocolate ganache cover with the cookie crumbled on top and was filled with a makeshift cookie dough. The other had a melted ice cream glaze, was also filled with cookie dough and cookie crumble. And then the other one was a traditional donut with the melted ice cream glaze and some cookies on top. They're all great. We're gonna make them even greater and uh, we're gonna try a couple different versions next week with 
the cookie dough filling with cookie chunks in it, and even more of the ice cream glaze on top. You guys are gonna love it. Round two, salty donut tasting. Let's go. Game day, it's the official launch of my Salty Donut collaboration today. To launch it, we are going to host a workout upstairs. There's about 100 people that signed up to do a quick workout with me, and then they'll come downstairs and earn themselves uh, one of the donuts. We've wanted to send the donut into one of the uh, incinerators. There's like a little machine that you put the food in and it burns it and tells you exactly how many calories it contains. I'm not entirely sure. If I had to guess, I would say that it's gonna be like, probably gonna be like two, 300 calories in one donut. I might be way off on that, but I think that an 11 minute AMRAP of moving and grooving like we're gonna be doing today is gonna be enough to balance it out. And I'll go through all of those right now and then we can kind of all move around and get situated. But 11 minute AMRAP, 11 lunges, 11 air squats, 11 burpees, 11 minutes. We're going in. Three, two, one, go. Part one, 11 jumping lunges. Let's have you guys go synchro for that last minute, okay? Synchronize, both partners at the same time. Ready, set, go. Start a fresh round. Three, two, one, and we are done. Real quick, before we get out of here, everybody, while you're nice and sweaty, let's bring it in. We do this at Peak 360 all the time. We're gonna, uh, we're just gonna break it down. Quick review of what we uh, went through just now. You guys did 11 minutes of work. Awesome job. Give your partner a high five. They deserve it, right? You know, the whole time. And then give you a high five. I'm gonna come around and get a high five for everybody. I don't know if I'll make it all the way around the circle. Boom! You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for being here. I set it downstairs, 
and I'll say it again, we kept the workout short and sweet, but the donut is even sweeter. So head downstairs. They're just gonna check your name off the list one more time to make sure that you guys get your donut. I hope you guys love it. Um, we'll bring our hands in right now. We'll break it down. We're gonna go donuts on three. Cool? Sound good? So we'll go one, two, three, down, up, and say donuts, right? One, two, three, donuts! Settled on a donut filled with cookie dough dipped in a melted ice cream glaze topped with a cookie crumble and sea salt. That was it. We did the workout. Everybody got the donut. We had a few leftovers. We were able to pass them out, let other people try it that may not have been able to try it otherwise. And I think today was a success. I'm gonna go pig out on one of those donuts myself. So the donut is gonna be officially available this Tuesday, November 13th at the Salty Donut. You can come and get the donut. It'll be available for 10 days. Make sure you come pick one up. All right, here goes nothing. <laughs>